In this video, I wanna share a tool that I discovered at the beginning of the year, and I'm not a paid affiliate of them or anything like that, I'm just doing this video because I think this is an awesome tool. What it does is it automatically shares your Etsy listings to all of your social media accounts, like Instagram, Facebook, Pinterest, Twitter, LinkedIn, all of them and it's awesome because it's one of those things it's a set it and forget it kind of situation you can program it to post as often as you want so if you wanted to post every day just once or three times a day ten times a day if you really want to spam everything you can program it to do just about anything on that you can set the exact times a day that you wanted to post um, and, and you know I tried this out for the last six months or so on my accounts because I wanted to make sure of what this was going to do to my engagement and how it was going to affect people clicking onto my Etsy shop and all of that before I did the videos so that way I could give you a real review of how this works and how this has impacted my business it's called deliver it and I've posted a link below if you'd like to go there and check it out but what it is is you can share for free just to try it out to two different social media networks and that's what I would suggest at first because what I did was I started sharing with Facebook and LinkedIn at first and then I added Twitter and Instagram later because Instagram has actually become like a recent feature they didn't used to have that a few months ago but I think for the last month or month and a half or so they've been having Instagram auto posting too so I added that also to my account but if you want to use all the different posting services then you have to pay ten dollars a month and at that point you can post to as many different things as you want from as many different feeds because it's not just that they auto post from Etsy but they also auto post things like like your YouTube videos and other feeds if you have like a blog or RSS feed that you think would be relevant to your customers. So now I'm in the dashboard and you can see that I have my Etsy shop here and then I have my socials. I'm sharing to seven of them, a couple different LinkedIn because one of them is my personal LinkedIn and then I also have it automatically sharing to my art galleries um, business LinkedIn. This one's my Instagram and my Facebook, my business Facebook page. They cannot share to your personal Facebook profile yet. I wish they could. It shares to my Tumblr, which I don't get much traffic on, honestly, but I thought I would put it on here and try it out. And it shares to my Pinterest. You can pick whichever Pinterest board or boards that you would like to program. So you could have it share to multiple boards uh, at different times of the day as well. And then uh, Twitter and it shows you like the last item that posted. You can also go up here and you can look at the queue and it will show you because it can fill your queue in with all the different options that you have selected. There we go. Now this is the queue for my LinkedIn. You can also look at the queue for the Facebook. There's similar posts in here, but what I have, let me just show you this one if you edit it. I've programmed it so it says the title of my Etsy listing and it says by Crystal Cole Fine Art and then it has the link, the full actual Etsy link because on default, the Deliver It program it will give you a shortened deliberate shortener link but I like to have the actual link in there that says Etsy and not the deliberate shortened link I think it's better because people can see exactly where they are going to be going when they click on it and they're familiar with the shop Etsy whereas deliberate they're not so familiar with that so I'm not going to go in any further into all the features of deliberate I could actually make a whole tutorial video on that for you but I did just want to kind of give you a little peek inside so you could see now if you're interested in trying it out. I mean, it's free to hook up two of your socials to it, so you might as well give it a try. Next, I want to show you the stats on my Etsy shop. This is showing you how much activity I've had since January of this year all the way through this month. The thing that's interesting that I want to show you is check out my social media here, down here. Look at how much. I mean, I've got in this last year 528 people to come from Facebook, and this is not with ads. This is just posting the deliberate auto post links from my Etsy shop where I just said it and forget it. I'm not doing anything with it. Same thing with Pinterest. I stopped using my Tailwind and started using this instead to test it out. And I've gotten way more views and clicks from the links from my Pinterest onto my Etsy shop. I mean, it's up 162%, but, but Facebook, I mean, up 52 
thousand percent. I mean, that's amazing, right? And then my Twitter is up five, basically five thousand percent. You know, I've got a hundred and one people to come from my Twitter. And the reason why it's up so much on Twitter is that I didn't really use Twitter before that much, and so now I'm using it because it's just auto posting every day, and <laughs> so it's easy to use. Uh, my Instagram is up twenty eight visitors. And lastly, Tumblr down here, you can see I had zero people click from those links the entire year, and so maybe I don't have something configured right on Tumblr, or maybe it's just that my Tumblr account sucks. <laughs> you know, I don't really use it much. The only reason why I have it is just kind of to stake claim to it, to have a Crystal Cole Fine Art Tumblr account, but I don't really post anything on there other than this auto post stuff now through here. But aside from that, I don't really post much on there. So it doesn't surprise me that I didn't get any people to click from there. In closing, I hope you find this information helpful. If you have any questions about the configuration of Deliver It to be able to get it to actually post to where it looks good and it doesn't look like a computer is doing it, feel free to ask in the comments. I'll try to give you tips. I might even make another video if there's enough interest in an actual tutorial for getting Deliver It to display your links and your Etsy posts to look as natural as possible because it took me a little bit of trial and error to figure that out. So yeah, so if you're interested in that, just let me know in the comments and I'll make that video for you all. Well, thank you so much for watching. See you next time.